Coach, how are you doing firstly? How are you coping during lockdown? Yeah, well, um, we have your frustrations and, uh, and it's also positives that are coming out of the lockdown. So what are some of those positives for you? Um, positives. Um, what can I say? Um, maybe I'm not the best. Okay. You have time to work on yourself. You got time to work on 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 your own issues, and um, you reflect on yourself. And you you take a lot of notes, saying what you need to do to improve yourself. What you need to do to improve the team. So I I become the writer. I'm the writer now. <laughs> And you've also been keeping in touch with the boys. You were just watching them train, isn't it? Yeah, I was just, we just finished the session now. Three minutes, we just came in three minutes late. Um, I just watched the whole session and checked with the boys. And uh, we are all there with the technical team to check on them. And we can see if they're doing right. We're coaching from, from home to the base of feet a bit higher. And, you know, work a bit harder, faster. Whilst you're at home. So, yeah, those things to do, but you also have a lot of time to to reflect on your team, to reflect on, on the opposition, to reflect on games that I, I record a lot of games. Uh, five games. <laughs> so, you record a lot of games, record a lot of games that I never had a chance to to, to watch. So, you give me a chance to watch, and I also watch. The Champions League, huh. you know, how other teams have been playing in other groups and prepare for next year. No yeah. DSTV, no catch up, no nothing, no. just football. No, I, I have other things to do. I, I, I'm, I was supposed to have logged in yesterday on the, the Chicago Bulls thing. Um, Michael Jordan was yeah. just uploaded on Netflix yesterday. So I thought I'll have time to, to watch it, but I didn't have time to watch it. So that's one of the things that I'll be going back to, to watch tonight. But I have time. I I I, I read a lot. I, I it's a lot of hmm. Is that Trevor Noah there? <laughs> yeah, I've got everything. Oh wow. Yeah. That's amazing. So there's a lot of positive to do and spending time with your family, spending mm. time. With uh, my youngest one, who's a football player, nine year old, and seeing, making sure that I, 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 I help him on the trainings, online training sessions that comes mm. from his coach. Hmm. And, and, and I even reflect, I see that player where his weaknesses and his strengths are. So I can also help him a little bit because. I don't have time to train him. Other people are mm. training him because I have to train other people. So, yeah, you got to, you got you got a lot of things to do. The board games, you play Ludo, mm. you play Monopoly. Oh, good! You reflect and you. you it's, it's good. Also, your phone is a bit quieter. Not just football loving people, South African public in general. What message of positivity do you have for them? The easiest thing is, you know, if if you stay away from from other people if you practice social distancing and, and you stay home. Mm. Uh, we have a less chance to get it. Mm. It takes time, but we will. Yeah. Just stay home, be positive, keep fit. I'm training more than I ever, ever trained in the last 10 years. So there's a routine. I'm on the treadmill there. So I was joking with the players. I was saying, uh, Dennis and Younger say, yeah, you trained once with us. I joined them. On the training, and my glutes are still stiff until the end today. So, <laughs> so it's an okay. intense training session. The guys are going to be ready when we resume. <laughs> no, that 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 session is a bit intense. I'm telling you, you get stiff for the rest of the week. <laughs> so he's asked Dennis and Yango say, "What happened to you? You disappeared?" I said, "No, I'm not disappeared. Do you see me?" Uh, so I put the camera on, and I'm on the treadmill. And, and I said to him, so I, 
I take a walk to all of your homes, watch you train individually. <laughs> so I'm, I'm doing the journey walker there and I'm watching them. So it's beautiful. I, can, I, I take my one one hour walk and I'm watching them train. <laughs> That's brilliant. See, um, that's the, that, that's the positive that comes out of it. Yeah. And you also said another positive is time to reflect. So I want to just ask a couple of questions looking back um, at the career of Coach Pizzo Mosimane, right? What is your best memory in football as a coach? Oh, you're kidding me. You know, I don't know how to answer that. I think the memories or the best moments change changes all the time. I think the best memory, the first ever, is, is coming in as an interim coach and at Super Sport United. And I won my first game. First game, I won my first game. So imagine uh, how, what a good moment it was. And and then you move over, we move over to Super Sport. What was another one? Uh, we won the top eight. Oh, another best moment. Mm-hmm. We qualified for Champions League group stages. I don't know how, how long it was. That. And it was also my best moment to play Esperance. Uh, Jean Dark and the uh, US in our know, group was also my best moment. And the best moment also was winning one game in the Champions League group. Oh, mm-hmm. uh, Super Sport United, then played, I think it was 18 or 19 at the time, winning a, a, a match in the group in Champions League. Mm-hmm. So so the moments changes when you became the coach of Bafana and the first match in Bafana, you play against Ghana. Ten days after Ghana were eliminated in the 2010 World Cup, I think you remember that super team mm. that we, we we adopted this Bakana for Ghana. You remember? Yes. We brought the same team ten ten days back in South Africa, and we beat them mm. with the same with the same team. So another best moment to win your first game as a coach mm. in in Bafana, and then we move on. We win the first title, the championship. The sundown, your best moment. You win the Champions League, your best moment. You walk through the tunnel in the World World Cup, World Club Championship, mm-hmm. World Club, where on the other side is the Real Madrid there and everybody training alongside there. And then you say the best moment. You win coach of the year, best moment. Africa coach of the year, best moment. Mm-hmm. So where where can you say? What can you do? What can you say is it's a lot of bad moments. They just change with time, you know. Yeah. Coach, we're really missing our football right now. What do you miss in your daily routine? What do you miss the most? Uh, I think I miss being on the pitch with the boys. Um, I miss, I miss uh, giving them a, a different training plan, a football train that I would like them to do. And, and, and struggling with them on the training pitch to say we need to move like this because we've got a lot of ways we play we don't just play play we've got a lot of principles that we apply so I'm, i missed it but if you on on the contrary to that oh i'm happy to be home who are some of the best players that you've ever uh, coached oh, yes. i don't know there are a lot of good players i've coached i've watched them come in and go i've watched surprise movie i've watched as Ramyandoro, I've watched Ali Shkun, mm. I've watched Piko Mudise, I've watched Pelende, I have Pekana now, yes. different players with different abilities, characters, Mapunda, mm. what a character, mm. Kiki Doli was here, mm. Kama was here, I don't want to talk a little bit more about Kama because I don't want problems, you know, Yeah, yeah. but uh, yeah, I don't want to say much about that. Yes. But uh, Bongani Zungu, one of the boys who, who, who could understand, listen, understand and put things into practice the way you, you put it. Yeah. You know, pass it out yeah. on a brave boy. A, a boy who can take the game on his shoulders, in his shoulders, and say, that one I'm taking for the team. Yeah. And he will deliver the game for the team. So we have a lot. I mean, Kyle Ten, that's why I mean, Tila, you watch how Fina play football sometimes. It's unbelievable. You yeah. see the intelligence and and Tembas one skating every day. Yeah, you know. So so there are a lot of players. Captain Serena can turn direction at any time. Dennis and Yango can save you the game. Mm. 
So uh, there's a lot, there's a lot. So I can't say this one. Tabunted or what I put it there. Do you get pranked in camp? Yeah, there was a one prank that uh, 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 at the end he went home. <laughs> they no, he went home. They, they, I always have a book where I do notes, and and they took my book, and I was looking for my book, but in 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 my book I had exclusive information. The the future, the players that I think must come next year, and that information they couldn't even bring the pool back because when they realized, oh, this is going to be a lot of stuff. So whoever took it, even until today, that's not about it. But I know there were two, three players who were involved, and they went through it, and that somebody saw that, oh, I think somebody's got in my position. Because uh, at Sundowns, we, what, what I do, I, I have the team for next year. Yes. I have the team. No, I don't buy it into it. not working for you. I, I buy last year. Mm -hmm. I have two players that we have already bought last year, and they are coming, and you know them. Anyway, the question was on the prank. So that book was was, was taken and was stolen, and I, I have never seen the book until today. And they've never tried to prank you again? They never tried to prank me again, because if you prank me, you're going to get information that you say, oh, I shouldn't have died. Do you enjoy <laughs> Twitter? A lot of people are very excited when you got into Twitter, but do you enjoy it? Yeah, we enjoy Twitter. Um, yeah, it can be true also. Mm. You know, you've got, to, you've got to be tough. Uh, you've got to learn not to react and respond. Yeah. Uh, whether whether it hits you or not. You yeah. know, you've got to enjoy it. It's, it's, yeah. Because it's open. It's open. Everybody says what you want. Yeah. You've got people who love you. You've got people who don't like you. Yeah. And you've got, you've got people who, who will just comment for the sake of commenting. Purely mm. lockdown question and everybody's struggling. Are you having a very good relationship with your fridge right now? A much closer relationship than ever before? With my fridge? Yes. I, I, I try. I try as much as I can to avoid uh, the fridge. And, and what helps me is the level of training that I do. You know, I'm now training. I never thought I can train every day. Yeah. You know, even if you don't do much, you just walk on the treadmill for 45 minutes or I'm on the bike. Mm. Or, or I join the players. Mm. And my daughter's also my daughter also has an app that is uploaded and three times a week there's heavy training that they do in the house. There's uh, our doing boxing. Mm. Oh no no good. I love I love I love it. I never thought I can enjoy boxing. So I was doing boxing. And uh was good I felt like Muhammad Ali or, <laughs> or Mayweather. You know? So uh, <laughs> ah, there you are boxing is nice. So yeah, that's 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 how I'm avoiding the fridge, or yeah. that's how I can maybe um, go against the fridge by training, and then you can go to the fridge. Definitely, coach. Uh, that's all the questions I actually have. So thank you very much for your time. Much appreciated. I will put this up on Friday. Can I ask you a question? Yes, can you can you ask. <laughs> how are you coping with your job? I'm doing okay. I'm staying positive. I miss football though. I really do. I miss what we love it's so much a part of our lifestyle of our identity of our enjoyment of our work i just miss it man i miss those yeah. in inter interviews with you that's gonna get twitter yeah. going again and your crazy sayings as well you know benefiting and stuff like that <laughs> hey don't don't talk about that weight <laughs> That, that that word has created the problem. I just said wait because I say you know me. I just something comes up. Yes. Know, and I, I I never thought maybe the, the word that is so important in football. You know? <laughs> it's the word of the season, definitely. Word of the season.